today, War Room Land, Minions, Lemmings, Cousins, I want to talk briefly about an obtuse, nonsensical, moronic cretin. You guessed it. Philadelphia Eagles own my homie, Jason Peters. This oversized buffoon was arrested Saturday night, as Devin alluded to, while leaving a Rick Ross concert for a loud music violation. Reports say that police asked Peters to turn down the music in his car several times, and he refused. He reportedly also refused to show the police his ID. How ridiculously stupid is that? Of all the battles that you'll ultimately fight in your life, going at it with the police over the volume of your music is just not a wise choice. And assuming that this was an aftermarket car stereo system making all this noise, who the hell is still putting systems in their whip in 2011? I thought car systems played out at the turn of the millennium. So not only are you an overgrown sack of rotten buffalo bile fluid who is weak and insecure with an ego that rivals the size of your waistline, you're also a corny, played-out, no-good, rotten catfish vulture in need of a style makeover. Like I told you last time, locate the nearest pit of unfortunate and get your Michael Phelps on. Maybe that will keep your big dumbass out of trouble. And with that... Kuwait is the war room with five nights at the round table, five Philly guys diversified and educated.